Live from News 9 WAOW, this is News 9 at 6. Disturbing details surface after death of an area child. Why authorities believe the parents are responsible. Fire breaks out at a Schofield apartment complex. It was through the roof when we arrived. Tonight, people living there reflect about the priceless items lost. A new child care program is facing staffing issues that are keeping it from opening. Why one official still has high spirits. News 9 WAOW, we've got you covered. Tonight, we are hearing from people living at that Schofield apartment complex where flames burned several garages there earlier today. Thank you for joining us. I'm Melissa Langbetten. And I'm Brad Hanson. News 9's Katherine Halverson is live at the scene in Schofield. She spoke with neighbors who lost belongings in the fire and has the latest from officials. Katherine? Yep, even though uh, the fire here at Metro Center Apartments is out, the scene is still very active. As you can see behind me, people are still gathering outside residents, actually, to assess the damage for themselves. A lot of people still just coming home from their work days. Now, the fire happened earlier this afternoon, and it tore through a row of detached garages behind this apartment complex. Now, no one was hurt, but everything inside them, including some cars, is a total loss. One resident I spoke to was on his way home with his wife when they noticed the smoke. At first, they were worried the building was on fire and rushed to get their dog out. The apartments weren't on fire, but his garage was. In it, new bikes they hadn't even ridden yet. They also lost family photo albums telling us they thought storing things in their garage would be safe. I guess just thinking of all the things that you can't replace, you know, a bike and insurance and those things, that's fine. But, you know, it's the memories and the pictures and, and all of those things that are, that are gone that, you know, you just can't. Now, the fire chief said some apartments saw melted siding due to the heat generated and some cracked windows. He also tells me a special fire investigator has been on the scene to assist with finding a cause. And tonight, fire crews have put out a call for help asking anyone in the area, any residents, to send any camera footage they might have in their houses to help with the investigation. So, Catherine, what should people do if they lost items in the garage? What are they supposed to do at this point? Melissa, the Everest Metro Police Department says there's a packet available at the apartment complex or at the police uh, department with more information on what to do. Live